A one year old and four year old rushed to the hospital this morning when a fire broke out in their home. It happened on Elmdale Street. That's near Gratiot and Outer Drive on the city's east side. Sources tell us the children were home alone because their mother and grandmother left for the grocery store. Sean Lay spoke to a neighbor who called 911. The latest from Detroit's east side, this home had working smoke detectors. A neighbor clearly heard them going off. She did not hesitate to try to help and call 911. Wow, so glad I heard smoke detectors. A neighbor heard those smoke detectors going off inside this home on Elmdale. She called 911 and she did not stop there. I discovered it was smoke coming out of the window and I was bamming on the window yelling, bamming, and um, call 911. Her quick thinking helping get Detroit firefighters there right away. I love Detroit. Right on time, guys. She also helped firefighters try to find out if anyone was inside the home. I don't know. The car is not here. Those firefighters went right inside this burning home. Chief the Central, we got a report of children trapped in this dwelling. Send me an additional EMS. And they found two children, ages four and one, in a bedroom, and they were badly hurt. Chief Nine Central, we have both children out. Medic 13 is going to be taken to the receiving hospital. It was a, a very, very good job. A good job to get those kids out, but it was also clear that investigators confirmed. Those boys were left home alone. Well, there was a grandmother that was supposed to be watching the kids, and um, uh, she was not home at the time, so the, 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 the two youngsters were by themselves. But I didn't know the kids were home alone. Because if I had known that, I would have come over with a sledgehammer. I would have tried to get them out. Investigators tell us a grandmother lives at the home with her daughter, the mother of the two kids. Both mother and grandmother were not home. It's unclear where they were when the fire broke out. Both boys suffered severe smoke inhalation. The four-year-old also had burns on his face. From Detroit's east side, Sean Lay, Local 4. Now, those children are being treated for smoke inhalation, but they are expected to recover. Sources tell us Child Protective Services is now involved and is expected to request charges against the mother and grandmother. Investigators believe the fire may have been started by a laptop battery.